So today's video is just a quick tip in some usage of Mastercam, and we're gonna show you how using the spacebar can make your life a lot easier. So here we are in Mastercam, and we're doing some geometry creation. We've just made a rectangle, and we've accepted that, green check mark to complete it, and what if you want to create another rectangle? So typically you'd think you'd head back up here and click on the rectangle button again. Alternatively, we can use the space bar. So any function that you've just completed clicking the space bar will launch that function again. So I can make some more rectangles here. Space bar again, more rectangles. That's great, fantastic, right? Same thing works for deleting entities. Let's say I want to delete something. So I'm going to say delete. I want to delete that. Hit OK. If I hit space bar again, I can select that. I can pre-select, hit spacebar, and it deletes the line. This also works for toolpaths. I think this is probably the most likely use case of a function like this. So we're in, the, I say we're making a contour, and we are contouring around this rectangle here. We've hit OK, we've done our settings, completed our, our contour toolpath. I can hit spacebar again. It launches me directly back into another 2D contour operation. So quite honestly, that's the extent of this video. I just wanted to touch on that quick tip with the space bar. But since this video is so short, we've got some extra time to talk about a few things. And in our upcoming blog, so two weeks from today, we're going to be doing our blog from CMTS, which is the Canadian Manufacturing Technology Show. Now, it's not as big as the one going on right now over in Hanover, Germany, the Emo Trade Show. Just for comparison, if you look at the exhibitors, there's well over 2,000, whereas our Canadian show here is, is not, not quite as big, and we're sitting at, at roughly 600. So um, do some math, a third of the size. But still, it's a, it's a good show. We'll be at this show on the Wednesday, it's October 2nd. And we'll be posting some, some pictures and videos on our Instagram, and maybe a live stream if we can figure out how to make it work. So two weeks from now, our blog will be taken from some of the stuff we find uh, at least entertaining and informative at the CMTS trade show.